So guys, so today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a uh, DSi I bought off eBay. So yeah, I'll unbox it. I mean, yeah, I'll take this off. Uh, off. Okay, so here it is. Yeah, I got it from a company called uh, Game Hero. So yeah, came in five days. Actually, it was pretty good. Um, compared to like other items I've bought because of coronavirus, it takes longer, but yeah, let's see what it says here. So, yeah, it's in red. I would have liked it, like blue one, but yeah. Includes red Nintendo DSi system and a replacement stylus pen, so that's not the one that was originally in it, but. A charger is not required, but, I mean, included, but I already have a 3DS one, which is the same. Although these can be purchased separately on eBay. Blah, blah. Uh, the top screen is in excellent clean condition with very few marks. The bottom screen has some very light scratches to it, which should be expected through normal use of a touchscreen of this age. However, any marks are barely noticeable when the system is switched on. The casing of the system has no cracks, knocks, or any serious down signs of damage. These are uh, there are scuffs to the outside, which almost all used DS systems have. These become slightly less noticeable as the system is held away from bright lighting. The inside of the case, the inside casing of the system, is in excellent condition with very few marks. Highly sought after game system. So yeah, that's what it says. It's said in the description. So, um, yeah, get this off. That's wrapped very well. I really can't be bothered to get scissors, but... I think I can break it up. I'm gonna damage it. Okay, so I've got scissors, so there we go. Nice and easy. Okay. Yeah, it's in good condition. I mean, obviously there's scratches on it, but... Okay. Does it have an SD card? I have my own. It doesn't matter if there isn't, but... Just curious to see if there is one. Okay, no there isn't. There's a game inside. Yes, there's a black stylus. Okay, let's turn it on. See what happens. There we go. Ah oh, yes, it's a... It's a reset to factory defaults. So yeah, I didn't actually know that the DSi had a vol volume buttons like this instead of a slider. I mean, well, I, I do have a DSi, but I can't remember if it has that, but yeah. So, let's do this. English. <laughs> I'm not telling you where I live, you can probably guess. So, uh, yeah, today is the 26th, I think? It's May 2020. And the current time is... I'm not telling you the current time. Yeah, I always do it one minute after the clock, would I say, okay. Hmm. Yeah, okay, the person 50. Oh, wait, no, not the person 50. Um, there we go. Personal message. Uh, yeah, let's just say hack DSi, because I'm going to hack it anyway, so. D 
DSi like that. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I'm playing my birthday either. You probably knew it. You might, I don't know. Favorite color. Yeah, there you go. Parental controls. Nah. Oh, the memories. Twilight menu. Uh, no. Okay, let's check if everything works. Mm -hmm. So, one of the things I want to do is, well, I like, I bricked the home menu on my 3DS, so that's kind of why I bought this. But I also want to uh, put the system settings from the DSi on my 3DS, and um, there is way there are ways to do it. But you have apparently like I can't find a proper DSi non dump on uh, on Google because it's illegal to do it, obviously. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna get the one from this and put it in. So let's see. Oh, it has Flipmoof Studio on it. I don't, I don't know if that comes already on it, but... Okay, yeah, there's no SD card. But I'm just gonna get all, like, my DSi stuff that I had on my 3DS and put it on... on this. So, yeah. I'm gonna keep doing that. Okay, I'm gonna get connected to Wi-Fi as well. Uh, um, yeah, okay. Profile. Mm -hmm. Date, time, alarm. Cancel controls, touchscreen. Mic test, internet, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get connected. I'll do that off camera. Yeah, actually, um. Yeah, on in the DSi, if you want to connect to like modern Wi-Fi networks, uh, they have WPA2 security, because uh, the original DS only used WEP, which uh, I don't know very many networks of that anymore. But yeah, you can do it in the advanced setup. So I'll use connection five because I like the number five. Okay, I'll do it all off camera. So yeah, it does support it. Fortunately, so yes, it worked. Okay, so system information. Nah, okay. Hmm. Right, yeah, that's fine. Also, I didn't like the way on my D uh, my 3DS that all the DS. Uh, well, DSi were on DS titles, they always take forever to load. So I think on this, it's just... Quick and easy. I guess. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Well, no, I can't quit it. There. Yeah, okay, the auto camera is very interesting because it's on the floor. <laughs> My very first picture on this DSi.
Yeah, the album will soon be hacked. Whoops. <laughs> that looks like a face. Oh no. That is pretty epic compared to the 3DS's camera. Because you can't do that kind of stuff on it. Yeah, okay. Don't have an SD card in right now. Yeah, currently I'm on my computer. I'm backing up everything from my 3DS's SD card on the computer. So that I can... Because I can't have two SD cards in at the same time, so... I will miss the circle pad though. What to say? So yeah, here's Yeah, okay. The DSI shop doesn't work anymore anyway. It is pretty strange that you can still get DSiWare on the 3DS, even though DSiWare was meant originally for the DSi, but you can't get it on the DSi anymore. Huh, I decline. No, except obviously. Because then I can't use this shop that doesn't work. Let's go. Oh, I love this music. To be to be honest, I just like all the music on the DS. On any DS. <laughs> well, it connects. Using macro video would be good for that. Yeah, okay, it's taking forever. Oh, it's like I pressed the power button. Oh, yeah, let's go into DS Store and play. Yeah, it's just, I love, like, it only takes, like, two seconds for, for it to quit it, on, whereas on my 3DS it took, like, 15 seconds or something. But, yeah. Uh, I can't get picked to chat on my DS, uh, my 3DS right now. But I think the only difference between the original DS pick to chat and this one was, uh, focus... Yeah, the pen, you could write in rainbow colour. Like that, anyway. I actually got that on my 3DS, so yeah, I've watched it before. It's a video on... I, ...and can be found on the Nintendo DSi menu, <laughs> ready for you to enjoy. The quality. <laughs> Downloaded Nintendo DSiWare software, you'll always have a wide selection of titles to play endless. So I think I think the one I had on my uh, 3DS was uh Well I got it from someone else's dump, but uh it had a female voice instead. Yeah, the my the when I was using the DSi browser on my 3DS it stopped working because uh of the Wi-Fi setup. It wouldn't recognize it fully or something, I don't know. Because it probably got confused between whether to uh, choose this, the DS Wi Fi connection or the 3DS one. Uh, I don't know what I'm searching, but uh, Google. Okay, blah 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 blah. 
Oh, this video is 15 minutes long already. Yeah, okay, it works. Yeah. I'm still interested in DSi tube, I'll try that actually. Uh, I don't know what did I do. Okay. Home. Home for DSi. Is it repaired now? I thought it got like broke. Come on. Some apps are non functional. No. Stupid filters blocking it. It, it does that. Uh, I might have to try and get my phone's hotspot or something. Anyway. Finally, Flippant Studio. Yeah, okay, I'll skip this. Wait, does it actually have the sample flip notes? I thought they were on the SD card or something, I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. Let's start that again. Okay. Oh, I remember this one. <laughs> 3D! Okay, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty much it, yeah. I will hack it. Should I actually, should I do a tutorial on how to hack it? No, there's probably no point because there's already, um... <clears throat> yeah, I'll just do a video when I've already hacked it. Okay, bye!